guys, Gamer 551 and we're back with more Let's Play Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Um, in the last part we got to the boss, which is Phantom Ganon. Um, just a little distance. Just kill, I guess. God, I hate this boss. That's not fair. There we go. Took me actually 34 seconds to be in, but you know, it's life. Hey kid, you did quite well. It looks like you may be gaining some slight skill. But you have defeated only my fat. When you fight the real me, it won't be so easy. Actually, it is really easy. What a worthless creation that ghost was. I will banish it to the gap between dimensions. That's kind of creepy. Okay. okay now, we can get this heart container. Now we have eight hearts. Can't believe I failed so much at that boss, but... I was actually really sad. Oh my god, we're being made into money. Whatever, I like being made out of money. Money! Yum, 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 yum. Okay. In the chamber of the sages again. And now we get to see who the sage of forest is. Forest sage. Oh my god, it's Saria. Thank you. Because of you, I could awaken as a sage. I am Saria, the sage of the forest temple. I always believed that you would come. <laughs> because I know you. No. You don't have to explain it to me. Because it is destiny that you and I can't live in the same world. I will stay here as the forest sage and help you. Now, please take this medallion. Um, so yeah, in the chamber of sages, everyone's dead. Like, not everyone. Uh, my capture card doesn't like this view or angle, I guess. So I think everyone's dead, at least. I think the sages are dead. No, they're not. I mean, only Raru's dead. You receive a forest medallion. Sorry, it awakens as a sage and adds her power to yours, even though the medallion does cr doesn't do crap for you. Sorry, it will always be your friend. And now it transports you to the sacred forest meadow. Or in front of the Great Deku Tree, actually. Okay, so now... Huh, what's this? There's a little, uh... Tree. Someone's trying to grow it. it has got really cool eyes. He looks like Cloud. They look like Cloud's eyes. Oh my god, that's really actually kind of creepy. But it's cute. It's all cute and cuddly and fuzzy. Hi there, I'm the Deku Tree Sprout. Because you and Zarya broke the curse on the Forest Temple, I can grow and flourish. Thanks a lot. Hey, have you seen your old friends? None of them recognize you with grown-up body, did you? With your grown-up body. That's because the Kokiri never grow up. Even after seven years, they're still kids. You must be wondering why only you have grown up. Well, as you might have already guessed, you are not a Kokiri. You are actually a Hylian. Plot twist? I am happy to finally reveal this secret to you. Hmm. It's kind of cool. Oh. Backstory. Some time ago, before the King of Hyrule unified this country, there was a fierce war in our world. Oh, I remember this story. It's a good story. One day, to escape from the fires of the war, a Hylian mother and her baby boy entered this forbidden forest. The mother was gravely injured. Her only choice was to entrust the child to the Gaku Tree. The great man, uh, a child of destiny, so he took him into the forest. Uh, the baby was raised as a Kokiri. Now the day of destiny has come. He eat. Yeah, I can't read that fast, just say now. You are a Hylian, and we're always bound to leave this forest. And now, you have learned your own destiny, so you know what must you must do. That's right, you must save the land of Hyrule. Now, Link, break the curses on all of the temples, and return peace to Hyrule. Okay, let's do what he says. 
Um, hello. Did I not learn that melody yet? Crap. Okay. So what you're going to want to do is return to the Temple of Time, and Sheik will teach you a new song. Yeah. Oh, and then we can go get a few heart pieces as a kid, huh? Yep. Yeah, if you talk to the kids as an, as an adult, they'll be like, Hey, who are you? You look familiar or something like that. But, uh, yeah, I'm not going to, because... Eh, I don't want to. Hold on. Uh. Excuse me? That one tastes like french fries. Because I had french fries for lunch. And, well, I went to Carl's Jr. for lunch. Oh, okay. Um, in the com in, in the temple coming, in the temple coming up, we will be able to get a magic upgrade. Not in the temple, but in the area before the temple, we'll be able to get a magic upgrade. Okay. So let's just go back to the temple of time, and then Sheik will teach us a new song. Oh yeah, and I think I forgot to show this to you, but. Um, the bridge um, going into Hyrule Market Town. God, I'm trying to. My thumb kind of hurts on the analog stick, and I'm trying to control it using my other hand, but uh, that's not working. The bridge is just collapsed. When you get near the town, it'll get dark and scary. Did I? No. No, I haven't. Okay, now they're the Redeads. Creepy as ever. Through the Temple of Time, children. Okay. There's Death Mountain, looking cool. And such. Yeah. Yep, here's Sheik. You destroyed the wicked creatures that haunted the temple and awakened the sage. But there are still other sages who need your help. In order to awaken all the other sages, you must become even more powerful. You must travel over mountains, underwater, and even through time. If you want to return to your norm original time, return the Master Sword to the pedestal of time. Uh, by doing this, you will travel back in time seven years. It's kind of cool. Um, a time will come when you have to return here quickly. I will teach you this, this to you for when that time comes. The song to return you to the Temple of Time, the Prelude of Light. It's actually a really good song, of, in my opinion. Yeah, this is what I was trying to play earlier. And there's a light. Yep. Now, um, in the next episode, I'm just gonna go ahead and... No, I'm not. I learned thunder. Um, in the next episode, we will drop the... Well, hold on. As long as you hold the Ocarina of Time and the Master Sword, you hold time itself in your hands. Link, we shall meet again. You know, you can also hold time in your hands by picking up a clock. That works too. Um, yeah, we have time. Hold on. Let me just go ahead and show you the um, uh, wrong song. God, I forget the Minuet of Forest. That's the only one that I can't remember. I can't memorize, I mean. Okay. Yeah. Okay, this is what a teleporting song does. Um, and there are as many melodies of this as there are temples. So, so there are six songs. Six transporting songs and six normal songs. Am I right? 
Yeah, I'm right. Okay, so in the next part, we will um, drop the Master Sword back into the pedestal and become a kid again. And then I will get another heart piece. Well, I think another heart piece. And then, um, yeah, get another heart piece and more rupees. And then we will, yeah, do more stuff. We're probably going to do plot things. But, um, and then maybe upgrade our magic meter. Um, yeah. So I'll see you guys then. Thanks for watching and goodbye.